हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम यू ऑल गाइस वेलकम यू ऑल टू एस कैट यूट्यूब चैनल आई एम अंकित शर्मा एंड वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम योर कैट एग्जाम गाइस लेट्स ट्राई टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन गाइस ए स्क्वायर प्लस ए बी प्लस ए इज इक्वल टू फोर्टी बी स्क्वायर प्लस ए बी प्लस बी इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी एट देन वॉट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ ट्वाइस ऑफ ए प्लस बी इट इज द एक्चुअल क्वेश्चन दैट हैज बीन आस्क इन ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू गाइज फ्रॉम स्लॉट वन गाइज ओके so guys in this question guys first of all guys what we can do a square plus ab plus a b square plus ab plus b do you all agree with me guys if i add these two equations i will have a formula of a plus b whole square how sir because i know that when i add these two equation a square plus b square plus ab plus ab plus 2ab and then in last a plus b Plus a plus b must be equal to. If we have, if we have added the LHS, we should add the RHS as well. Twenty-eight plus fourteen, that is forty-two, guys. Students, do you agree with me? This form has become a plus b whole square. We all know this formula, the most fundamental formula. A plus b equal to forty-two, guys. So, do you agree with me, guys? Because a and b are natural number. Question is saying that. A and B are natural number, guys. Okay, A and B are natural numbers. So, guys, if A plus B and A plus B, let's assume A plus B as x beta. A plus B, I am assuming what beta? A plus B equal to x. So, it will be what, guys? X square plus x equal to forty-two. Yes or no, guys? And now we all can solve this quadratic equation, guys. X square plus x equal to forty two. So I am solving here, guys. X square plus x minus forty two equal to zero. If I make uh, now, it has become what beta? If I, uh, it has become a quadratic equation, we all can solve this. X square, the factors of minus forty two, the sum, uh, the difference between those two factors must be equal to plus one. So you will see plus seven x minus six x. Minus forty two equal to zero. So on solving this, it is quite obvious. We all can solve this. X plus seven into x minus six equal to zero. So two values I will get here. The first is x equal to six beta. If x minus six equal to zero, x equal to six. If x plus seven equal to zero, x equal to minus six, minus seven. And because a and b are natural number guys, and x is denoting a plus b guys, so two natural numbers sum cannot be negative. That's why this will be eliminated. Only x equal to six will be taken by us. Now, guys. Now, but question wants what beta? Question wants two a plus b. Question don't want. Uh, question doesn't want beta. Uh, what is the value of uh, a plus b? Question wants what beta? Two a plus b. So, students, if a plus b we have got a plus b equal to six we have got, then if I take my first option, guys. So, do you agree with me? What I need to find out if two a plus b's value is equal to seven. If a, if option a is the correct answer, then we will take like this. And now I will split two uh, a as a plus a plus b equal to seven. Do you agree with me? It is six. So a must be equal to what, guys? Seven minus six, one. If I put a equal to one, are my conditions getting satisfied? So just uh, put here, guys. If a equal to one. Then b must be equal to what, guys? We all can find if if a equal to one, we are getting okay. Let me solve this. A plus b equal to okay. Uh, it is six, guys. Six plus a equal to seven. So a will be one only. So if a is one, b must be what, guys? B must be five because two into one plus b equal to seven. So two plus b equal to seven. So two plus five equal to seven. So b must be five, guys. Put a equal to one, b equal to five. So you will say if I put a equal to one here, b equal to five in this condition. One is square plus one into five plus one. So it is only seven, guys. But we must have fourteen. That's why option A cannot be the correct answer. Are you getting my point? Let's check for the second option, beta. Let's take two uh, a plus b as what, beta? Two a plus b equal to ten. We know that a plus a plus b. 
we will split guys because we know the value of a plus b guys so in this case a will be equal to what guys 4 because a plus b is 6 beta if a is 4 if a is 4 then b must be 2 guys if i put a equal to 4 and b equal to 2 are my condition getting uh, are my conditions are getting satisfied so you will say sir a square plus ab plus a a equal to 4 4 square sir a equal to a square 4 square we are getting sir and the sum of these three values must be equal to 14 they all will be natural number so if it is 16 itself how it can be 14 so that's why option b also cannot be the correct answer are you getting my point guys but if you will find the value here guys you will come to know 4 square plus 4 into 2 uh, plus 4 so you will get here what beta 16 plus 12 28 here and here you will get for beta 2 square 4 plus 8 plus 2 so here you will get 14 are you getting my point so here do you agree with me guys do you agree with me sir on putting a equal to 4 we are getting 28 on putting a equal to 4 we are getting 14 in this equation so if i change the values you can you can uh, eliminate the options as well but uh, how you should do guys you, you sh should use your basic common sense guys that if i am if i will put a equal to 2 right now i am putting a equal to 4 b equal to 2 if i reverse the values if i reverse the values guys a equal to 2 b equal to 4 okay uh, you can go like that but we are damn sure option uh, b cannot be the correct answer let's take option d guys uh, you can check option c as well okay uh, let's take option d let's take it is equal to d so in that case a plus a option b 8 guys a plus a plus b equal to 8 a plus b is what guys 6 so in this case a will be what guys the value of a will be 2 only if a is 2 b must be 4 and now we will check what beta like on putting a equal to 4 b equal to 2 we are getting the reverse values we are getting 28 here 14 here uh, and if we split the values uh, if we reverse the values b equal to 4 a equal to 2 uh, then definitely we will get 14 here because the form is same guys a square plus a b plus a b square plus a b plus b okay students so that's why guys option d is the correct concept the value of 2a plus b the value of a equal to 2 b equal to 4 that is acceptable beta are all conditions are getting satisfied on a equal to 2 and b uh, a equal to 2 and b equal to 4 so this is how we are going to solve this kind of questions guys i hope it is crystal clear to each and every one we are going to meet in the next class with some more amazing questions and concepts till then bye bye take care thank you so much guys